everyone, today we are going to be seeing how far I can drop my tractor slash 4x4 off my ramps. So before we get straight into the action, I just want to mention a couple of things. First of all, I am really sorry about the last video. The audio was terrible, I don't know what happened. I played the video back on my editing software and it was perfectly fine. So it must have been a, um, a malfunction during the upload, but it, um, it's fixed now. I uh, really hope it doesn't happen again. Also, we are so close to reaching 100 subscribers. Thank you so much to all of you. Uh, just to let you know, when I reach 100, we're going to be going to the skate park and we're going to be airing out my Slash and my X Max out of the out of the bowl. So that should be a lot of fun. So I'm just going to stop talking and let's get into the video. All right. So what we need to do is we're going to start from here, and I've measured five meters. And then we're going to use this measurement here and see how far we can make. I've given up to five meters, five meters just there. If we need to extend it, then we can. Uh, so I've got these ramps kind of spaced out. I know it seems like it won't go as far. Uh, you may have to modify it to get over the badminton net. But uh, I'm going to stand from here so I can kind of watch where the car lands. And last thing I want is it veering off and then hitting somewhere. So I kind of want a rice air surface area the slash to hit so i'm just gonna set it up and then we will be ready all right it's some um, bit windy so sorry if you can hear wind noises but we're ready i hope this goes well i really don't want it to break i'm gonna go easy for a start because it is slightly wet and i don't want to have the wheel spinning and then it goes out of control so i'm just gonna see roughly what it does so oh 12 feet, 12 feet, let's see where it was about. I'd say around about here, yeah? 11 feet, I'd say. All right, let's get it again, I need to hit it harder. All right, here we go. Hey! Okay, Bam, 13 feet, which is, let's have a look. Where's 13 feet? Three, nine, six and a half, that's nearly four meters. All right, I'm gonna see if we can get it any better. All right, so I'm gonna actually hold it flat out right through the air. Here we go. Yeah. I reckon that was 14 feet, 427. I'm really happy. I wanna get it again. I might move the car further back. We're gonna give it one more shot, but this time I'm gonna stand right next to it so I can get more accurate. See. Fifteen and a half, four, six, 
five. You know, I think I'm gonna go straight to moving it a meter further back because I really want to hit five meters. Okay, so we've got the tape measure. Measured eight meters, that's as far as this thing can go. Still at six meters here. I'm really, really hoping we can reach five. The only reason why I put it up to six is just to see if we get any further and we can measure it out. There we go. Four sixty. That's less, which is weird because this is a meter further.
so far. And my God, some of those, those landings were so horrible. And I'm really quite impressed. The Loctite that I put at the end of the shock shaft has really, really done its job. Uh, I really, really don't. Just to let you know, I don't normally try to land these cars like that. I don't normally crash them like so hard. Um, I really don't know what happened. I found out at the end. I think it was just a slip, but then again, I can't really blame that. But um, yeah, that's it for this video. I really hope you did enjoy. If you did, then you can leave a like, subscribe. Make sure if you do subscribe that you press the um, notification button. Also, you might have noticed I have actually changed my camera settings to 4K at 60 FPS. I'm not sure if there is a difference. Uh, when you see the video, when I, when I watch the video back, we probably might see a difference. But that is all I've got to say for this video. I hope you have a brilliant day or week ahead, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.